And with those bitterly cold temperatures, experts say it's important to winterize your home, or it could mean a flooded house and costly repairs. KSNT News reporter Gretchen Kanan joins us with more. Gretchen, what should people watch out for? Chase, well, it may sound simple, but letting your faucet drip could save you from a burst pipe. The American Red Cross says running water through the pipe, even at a trickle, helps prevent pipes from freezing. They also suggest opening kitchen and bathroom cabinet doors to allow warmer air to circulate around your plumbing. I talked with a local plumber who says there are some important things you need to remember before the cold weather this weekend. Crawl spaces, put some heat down there in some, in some fashion or another. Close up any openings you have. Uh, if there's vents or whatever, make sure they're closed so that no cold air can get in there. A heat source would be the best solution. Um, take off your hoses from your f f spigots outside. Make sure they're not hooked up. Even though they're frostproof, they'll still freeze and burst. And when you go turn that on is when you'll find out that you'll, you'll flood your living rooms, basements, wherever that hose happens to be tied in at. Bill says he responds to many burst pipes this time of year, and if you do plan to travel this weekend, he suggests setting the heater in your house to at least 60 degrees. And while it may seem pricey to turn that heat on, he says it's better to be safe than have a burst pipe. Reporting live in Northern Shawnee County, Gretchen Kanan, KSNT News. Those could be costly repairs. Gretchen, thank you.